Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, I am going to show you two ways to export a part of the timeline in Filmora 9. Since Filmora 9 does not have the option to select a part of the timeline for exporting similar to other video editors, this is the workaround that I normally use, and you can follow my steps too. Let's getting started now. Here I am in Filmora 9 editing interface with my example project. Let's say I want to export just a part of this timeline, then I will bring it back to the media library so that I can continue to work on this project. The first way I can do is to save this project, and save as a new project. Then export that new project into a video format that I want. After that, I will open this project again to work with it. Firstly, let's save this project to avoid losing our work. Go to the file menu, select save project. Or, you can also press Ctrl S on your keyboard. This is the name of our current project. Don't forget it. Now go to File, select Save Project as with a new name. Let's say Cleaning Day Part 1 as this is a part of the Cleaning Day project. Click Save. Now we are in our new project, Cleaning Day Part 1. We can delete the part that we don't want to export now. For example, if I want to export just the beginning of the project. All I need is to highlight all the parts that I don't want to export, and delete all of them. Being noticed that in Filmora 9, you can select multiple parts on the timeline by press and hold your left mouse click, then grab the parts that you want to select easily. You can also press and hold your control keyboard, and select parts with your left mouse click too. Now I will export this part and bring it back to Filmora after finishes. Click find the target so that we know the location of the exported file. Here it is. We can go back to Filmora now. Close this export window. Go to file, select open recent project. Then select the project we are working on, that's cleaning day. Click yes if you want to save this cleaning day part 1 project. And here is the project we are working on. Let's import the exported part back to the media library now. That's easy, right? Another option you can also try is to save your project, delete unwanted parts on the timeline and export the project. After that, you can undo your actions by pressing Ctrl Z on your keyboard, or select undo option at the edit tab on the toolbar menu. This option is not recommended for those of you who are working on low-end pieces since the program may crash during exporting time. It's just another recommendation for those of you who want to try a new solution. Firstly, I will select the part I want to export, and group them into one part. Then, delete all other parts and export it. After that, close the Export tab and undo the actions by going to the Edit tab at the toolbar menu, select Undo. Or I can press Ctrl Z until the project return to where it starts. That's all I want to share with you in this tutorial. I hope you like it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Thanks very much for watching and I will see you in my next videos. Bye for now.